Hello everybody and welcome to another Route Master for Hire video here on YouTube. Got something a little bit different for you today. I hope you can hear me above all the wind noise. As you can see, I'm on the open topper. We're bombing along the A55 towards Liverpool at the moment at 45 miles an hour. Alan is downstairs driving and I've got the luxury of an open top bus all to myself. But I won't have the bus all to myself for long because we've got a booking with a bit of difference today. If you're a fan of Rugby League, you may recall a couple of weeks ago that St Helens won the Challenge Cup final at Wembley against Castleford. Well, after their victory, the club got in contact with us to say, can we borrow your open topper for a victory parade? Now, St Helens isn't that far away from us, so we said, yes, of course you can. So that's where we're off to today. We're off to St Helens, to the rugby club, where they're going to decorate the bus. Then after that, we're off to a local hotel to pick up the players. And then we've got a guided tour tonight, a police escorted tour around St Helens for a victory parade. So it's going to be a bit of a different video, this. Of course, you're coming with us to experience what it's like to hire our open topper out for what is probably going to be quite a rowdy event. Once we arrived, our first job was to help get the sides of the bus branded up. And ours was not the only open topper in the parade. This is a PD2 from the Northwest Museum of Road Transport in St Helens. They were using two open toppers because the ladies team also won some trophies this season. And after the branding, it was a short ride to the hotel to pick up the players and of course to do the usual media interviews. <laughs> and with everybody on the bus, it was time for the parade.
And finally, after a two-hour parade, we made it back to the stadium for one final photo shoot. Yes. Well, we're just leaving the stadium and once again it's been another great event. The players were fabulous, the fans, they were incredible. Lining the route from the Players Hotel all the way back to the stadium across various places in St Helens that I've never ever been to before. I can tell you where we went on the bus. We went all over the place, but there was crowds everywhere. The bus is in one piece, the players were really respectful for this old vehicle, which is always a worry of mine when you hire the bus out for these kind of rowdy events. So we're on our way home, it's going to take us about an hour to get there. Alan is driving, but we're going to stop for something to eat on the way back. It is a quarter to nine now, and we're both absolutely starving hungry. So thanks once again for watching, and remember, if you haven't done so already, give us a like, hit that thumbs up, and if you've not subscribed, please consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you very much indeed. Also, don't forget to put your comments in the box below. We'll read every single comment, and we love reading what you say about our buses and the channel. So from me and Alan, thanks again. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye.